This song is called The Second Cross. It was written by His Grace Duke Con McNeil. This song has, has two levels. It talks about a crusader coming back from the Holy Land and finding his life here not as rich as it was in the Holy Land and missing that past life. He juxtaposed that every time he went to an event and was in this magical society that we, that we reside in and then going back to the normal world during the week and how much he desired coming back to that magical land every weekend. It's called the Second Cross. Now speaks to me of sowing and reaping the fish pond, the vineyard, the ox, and the lamb. My soul through the groves of Damascus is wandering. Thou bidst me in duty thy careful words heed. For the shadows come o'er me from a time not forgotten. Bear me away to a land I once knew. My thanks to thee, steward, for the care of my manner. One more cup of good wine, and I'll hear none but thee. For I have seen Jerusalem, and I have shared battle and bread with the bravest men, dwell amidst the perils and pleasures of Utramir, and I have carved my cross on the wall of his tomb. Thou speakst to me of the deeds of young nobles, their loyalty, prowess, and honor untried. My soul rides the hot-blooded steed miss mine enemies. True tests of their virtues shall need more than words. And the shadows come o'er me from a time not forgotten. And bear me away to a land I once knew. The worth of a night I would measure in sterner mark. Yet one more cup of good wine and your words shall be heard. For I have seen Jerusalem and I have shared battle and bread who with the bravest men dwell amidst the perils and pleasures of Utramir, and I've carved my cross on the wall of his tomb. I weary discoursing of cattle and courtiers. This life here is lukewarm, no joy and no fear. And no deeds to truly test honor and chivalry. And good wine, a poor balm for so deep a wound. For the shadows come o'er me from a time not forgotten. And bear me away to a land I once knew. Words and deeds common like a scourge Play my aching heart, and languor and longing my burden and boon. For I shall again see Jerusalem, and I shall share battle and bread with the bravest men, dwell amidst the perils and pleasures of Hutramir. I shall carve one more cross on the wall of his tomb. For my soul stands sore charged till tis carved on his tomb. <laughs>